Take a look at what we have here at Unique, especially in Classics. Wow, you won't see one of these every day. 1935 Pierce Arrow, model 845, enclosed drive limousine, and it is a beauty. Dual side mounts, the wire wheels, wide white walls, and take a look at the bright work in the front of this car. One thing I also want to quick point out, I've kind of been told that uh, this little arrow and bow are very difficult to come by. I'm sure that there's some Pierce Arrow experts and followers out there. Add your two cents down below in the comments. Sure tell us some things about this car that maybe we do not know. As you can see, the turn signal indicators have been added to the bumper. And I do want to point out, there's a little delaminating on that front bumper. Still an absolute beautiful car though, no doubt about that. Take your time looking through the still pictures, you'll be able to see the underside, interior, engine bay. Still pictures can be seen at uniqueclassiccars.com. If you're seeing this on YouTube, just click on the link down below the video in the description. And that's going to take you right to our website where this pics will be, information. There you get a close up with wide white walls, and wire wheels with that Pierce Arrow wheel cover, passenger side mount. And as you can see, the paint shows well on this car. Driver's compartment, burgundy leather seat. We'll get around to the driver's side, check the dash out a little bit closer also. Uh, you can see that there is a glass divide right here that's operated by a crank in the rear which happens to be right here, and that is working. Also a shade for privacy, privacy shade. Kind of set it up back here so I have one jump seat up and the other one stored away. So they'll both store away like that, or you can flip them both out and have them up. You can see very nicely appointed riding compartment back here also. Headliners, a nice shape. Uh, one thing I want to point out too is you do have an intercom system here. There's a button right there and there's actually a place kind of where you speak right there and that will be broadcast out that speaker to the driver and that is in working order. Uh, another thing, listen to this door when it closes. They definitely do not sound like that anymore. Another thing to remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course, we can assist with transportation. This vehicle may be eligible for an extended service contract. Consult with your sales associate when you call in or email. This is one of 875 Pierce Arrows produced in 1935. There is a jack. In the trunk, you'll be able to see that in the still pictures. There'll be some other miscellaneous um, things pictured in with the still pictures. So take your time looking through those. Does have a straight eight. So inline eight cylinder underneath the hood. We've got 6.3 liters. Has a single Stromberg carb on it. That's the way it would have been produced back in 1935. Once again, uniqueclassiccars.com. Take your time looking through the still pictures. You take a peek at the driver's side. And again, you can see paint shows well on this side. I might say it's absolutely perfect throughout. No, but it, like I said, shows very, very well. You might find a small blemish here or there. But overall, this one is a stunning car. Definitely a head turner. Take a look at the door panels on the inside. Battery location is underneath the driver's floor right there. The switch will operate the lights. That switch is actually uh, like a throttle. 
for when starting. Freewheeler right here. So I want to have that pulled out. That way you can run it in reverse. Take a look at just the brackets for the visors, how everything was made on this, and considering it was 1935. All right, climb in here. I want to show you this gauge cluster a little bit and uh, some of the things on it. So it's similar to a Ford with the, the Keylax ignition, and this actually turns your ignition on and off. So with it up, we have ignition on. You can see our app meter moved here temp gauge oil and fuel now as far as starting it there's a few things under here that I want to show you this right here is the crank for the cowl vent and that does work there's a cowl vent that will pop up right in front of the windshield so let you know that that is working here let's put it up since we're doing this see it coming up right there there's a push button start right here, or you can pull this down once the car starts, push it back up. This is actually the heater fan and heater, which is right there. So for ease, I'm going to pump it a couple times. We're just going to push this one. That's how easily it starts. Uh, turning back off, push this down. And I'll show you how this other starter works. There's two ways to start it. Or some Pierce insignia. And looks like a looks like a maple, birch or maple maybe. All right, manual transmission. Let's make sure we're in neutral. Which we are. Of course, parking brake also. I guess what you could call a navigation system. peek in the driver's side rear quick. Great car for a collection. Taking your local roll-ins, cruise-ins, concourses. Like I said, you're not going to see one of these every day with a limited amount made. And that was of all Pierce model, or I should say that's all Pierce Arrow models. This is one of 875 produced. Here how nice and smooth it runs. Of course, the iconic Pierce Arrow rear lights. I'll have them set up. All right, let's slip up to the front. Now, of course, if you're driving and it was warm, you could open these up to help the warm air blow up underneath the hood. The hood latch is here on each side. We're going to open up both sides. I'm also going to take that arrow back out of that hood ornament so we don't lose it. It'll be in the glove box. And uh, let's check out this engine bay. We'll wrap up this video. Here we go. Both sides of the hood open. And uh, they may be similar to the hood sides on, oh, let's say, uh, Model A. But <laughs> these are a little bit heavier. Wow. Incredibly well built car, especially in 1935. And look at that engine again, inline six and uh, should be 6.3 liters. Look at how smooth that runs! Nice, clean, and tidy. Runs nice and smooth. Slip around to the passenger side here. I'll show you the carb is. Of course, the uh, intake manifold, exhaust manifold, the stropper carb, Pierce Arrow. Air cleaner there, intake. Wow. Remarkable piece of craftsmanship from 1935. What out of Buffalo was it? One you're definitely not going to see every day. Pierce Arrow, 1935, model 845. Good looking limo, call us 507 386 1726, uniqueclassiccars.com. We do consider trades, financing is available.
Of course, we can assist with transportation, and this vehicle may be eligible for an extended service contract. Consult with your sales associate when you call in or email. And uh, take a look at the still pictures. I forget to, forgot to mention it earlier. Uh, also a travel lodge, Pierce Arrow Camper. You're going to see in the still pictures. It's also on our website. Just wanted to mention that too. Great looking combination with this car. Check it out. Here we have a 1935 Pierce Arrow Model 845. Pierce Arrow, very luxurious automobile. Desired by politicians and Hollywood elite. Your camera, your location is nearly where someone would ride in the back seat of the limo. This car rides nice and smooth. Very smooth idle. This is a three-speed manual on the floor. Our turn signal indicators are working. The oil pressure is reading 40 pounds. Fuel gauge is just over a quarter. The temperature is coming up on 140 degrees. The amps are right in the middle of the gauge. The speedometer right here is working, showing 35 miles an hour. Definitely drawing some eyes driving this car. Brakes are working well. Pretty quiet running machine. I think along the lines of Cadillac maybe Packard, but higher end even yet. Very few built, very few remaining. The amount of work that went into the hood ornament alone is staggering. Letting go of the wheel, this car stays nice and straight. In the 30s, time when a luxury car was rare this was one of the top of the line take a look at all the pictures and learn more about this pierce arrow at uniqueclassiccars.com